Thank you for the amazing introduction. Today, right here in this amazing location, I'm going to introduce for the first time our new zero knowledge protocol, Pi squared or proof of proof. Pi squared will power the future blockchains and rollups because it will allow us to write smart contracts in any programming language and any virtual machine, and their execution will be correct by construction. Runtime verification and multiverse hacks have a long history of successful partnerships and collaborations. We held them from day zero to mathematically rigorously analyze their code and protocols. And because of that, because of these successful collaborations we had, we are currently discussing a new partnership where we will deploy Pi Square for the first time on Multiverse X. <laughs> Let us dream for a few seconds. How would an ideal ZK rollup look like? It should be universal. We would like to write programs, smart contracts, in any programming language, in any virtual machine, and to use the development environments and IDEs that we are used to. Also, we'd like it to be fast, but that's not enough. It must also be correct, and ideally correct by construction. How is that possible? That is possible thanks to recent research results both at runtime verification and in my lab at the University of Illinois, that allow us to reduce this general and pretty vague notion of verifying computational claims in any programming language to verifying mathematical proofs. So we reduce computing to mathematics. And the mathematical proofs will be verified using a universal proof checker that will be implemented as a custom, ultra-fast, zero-knowledge circuit. Okay, so the motto here is verify mathematics and you can verify everything. This is what will allow us to have correct by construction execution of programs, because it already goes through mathematics, proved correct, and then it will be deployed. And it will work with all programming languages and all virtual machines, simply because programming languages and virtual machines will be mathematical theories. What really happens under the hood is a very crisp and unique separation of concerns between programming languages and cryptography and put them together in something that is much bigger than the sum of the parts. The key framework that we developed over more than 20 years, the first ideas of the key framework came when I was a research scientist at NASA. Then in 2002 and 3, I moved to the University of Illinois Urbana Champaign, where we had the first prototypes. And since then, we continuously evolved the K framework. The K framework allows you to plug and play your programming language. And then, once you do that, it will generate mathematical proofs for everything you want to do with that programming language. To execute programs, to verify programs, everything, any kind of computational task. The only problem with mathematical proofs, especially with very, very rigorous mathematical proofs, is that they are large. Think terabytes size with all the steps. However, and that was the key insight that led to pi squared. However, you can verify mathematical proofs with a very simple proof checker. 
in the order of two, three hundred lines of code. And now if we can implement that proof checker as a zero knowledge circuit, now we can generate a cryptographic proof of existence for a mathematical proof. Proof of proof. And now, as I said, we plan together with the amazing Multiverse X team to bring this all to Multiverse X. This is how we look like. Programming languages, virtual machines, specifications of various protocols, all of these, which are usually hardwired in programs, will be plain data on the blockchain or in the rollup. For example, Solidity will be stored at a unique address where everybody knows that Solidity is stored or a certain version that we care about. EVM, same. ERC20 template, same. Even conventional languages like C, Java, LLVM, all of these will become mathematical theories, which we call formal semantics, and they will be stored as such on the blockchain as data. Now, when we want to compute something, when we claim a certain computation, that will be transformed by front-ends into a formula, like we see the blue formula here, or a theorem. And then that will be proved automatically and very fast. Don't be worry. Don't worry. Proof will be fast. And then we get the zero knowledge certificate. And that's the only evidence we need that the claim is true. And that can be verified with a very simple verifier, ZKP, ZK proof verifier, which will be the only program that needs to execute on the rollup as a smart contract. Consensus will be achieved by Multiverse X. So we build this solution on top of Multiverse X, and we get consensus for free which is hard, we get it for free. Notice that there will be no hardwired or predefined programming languages on virtual machines. There will not even, will not even need to have compilers and interpreters as we know them. So we don't have to worry about the bugs that usually come with this. And in spite of having no predefined virtual machine or programming language, and ironically, somehow, will be able to write smart contracts in any programming language or virtual machine. So we can use any programming languages in smart contracts, and we don't have to worry about the correctness of their execution anymore. So would you guys like to have this universal ZK rollup on Multiverse X? Okay, that was a question, really. So this room is great, but has bad acoustics. Would you guys like to have a universal ZK rollup on Multiverse X? Yeah. <laughs> cool. Thank you.